Good evening, y'all, and welcome back. All right, we have got a plethora, and when I say plethora, I don't know why that word came to my mind, we have got the multi-chrome duo showdown. So, as you guys know, if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Kaya. Sorry about the curtain. I got us a new curtain, and it was super duper long. It was all dragging behind me and looked crazy, so it is getting hemmed. If you're new to my channel, my name is Kaya. We do a little bit of everything over here. Tea, news, reactions, haul, drama, dog stuff, lifestyle, in between. And if you hear weird stuff, that is my puppy dogs in the background. So, let's hope this video turns out better than the Leia Beauty Tool Y'all, I was struggling with that. If you haven't seen, check it out. It is the Leia Beauty Tongue. Uh, Beauty Tongue. Leia Beauty Tool. And it's like that flippy, floppy beauty tool that looks like a tongue and something else and other things that we won't get into. But let's go ahead and get into. We've got quite a plethora of things. And uh, yeah, don't mind. Usually I got a really nice curtain hanging. But. When I washed it, it had like this weird backing and it was like the sun was coming through and it was like spotty, cheesy looking. So I got us another curtain. So this is what we're twerking with in the meantime, in between time. And check this thing out. I got a while back. I know a lot of y'all, man, I bashed my knee earlier. It's just been one of them days, y'all. Do you ever have those? Well, I know most people do. One of those days is just like things don't go right. Everything's going wrong. Uh, we got the Alani Berry Pop Energy Addison Ray that we reviewed in the last video. I just knocked half of it over my desk. I was changing our little house batteries. I figure we'll rock this until we get our Easter stuff up. So, um, yeah. So, I've spilled the drink, bashed my knee, but anyways, check this thing out. Isn't that cool? I use that a lot of the time for my thumbnails, but I just love this thing. Um, I'm sure it's probably man-made, it looks like, but I just love this thing for thumbnails. All right, y'all, let's get right into it, and we have got quite a bit to do. So, grab a snack, grab a drink, and we will get into it. Um... We're not going to do a drink of the day because I did that in the last video. And, yeah, so I'm recovering. I bash my knee, like I said, and I'm falling apart. I get a raspy voice. So, let's talk about my eyes and what I did. And, it's guys, this is really hard. I'm hoping on the swatches it's going to be easier for you guys to see. Um... This just really, let me go ahead and see. I know that looks weird to do. It is really struggling for the ring light to pick this up. I tried turning it off, turning it, you know. So, let's go ahead and get into our first thing. And, yeah. So, let's do the first one. And I'm going to pull you up here. And off we go. So, as you can tell, the late night me a couple weeks ago, I actually have had this for probably about a month now. So, it's been a minute. So, late night Kaya is always on the hunt for new shiny chromed out things. And I figure this is kind of a, well, it's really only two brands now that I look at it. Let's get into the first one. This is the Natasha Denona Chromu, is it Chroma? Multi-chrome liquid eyeshadow, and this is called Scrab. Okay, there is tons of these. I could not decide which one to get. So here we go. Look at that. So it flips like purple to blue. Let me see if I can kick this, guys. It's really hard for any of this to do. Let me see if that... Yeah, that kind of helps it, actually. See how it really shifts. It's got green. It's got blue. It hits purple. Okay. 
Okay, and this is, again, Scrab. S-C-A-R-A-B. If you like videos like this, give me a thumbs up. I did purchase all this with my own money. And this is from the site Beautylish. So, here we go. And look at that. So here's the component again. And let's do one big old swatch here. Um, it's very smooth. It's definitely layerable. And I like it. It was very easy to work with. So that is one, look at the way that hits here. Let me, now guys, with these, you want to open them, use them, get them back in. You do not want this to dry out. It is a liquid. Um, let's play around here and see. So it's got that greenish, yellowish. Let's see. The light just does not do this thing justice. So as you can tell here in the package, I'm hoping you're seeing that the way it hits, that it's got that bluish and then you kind of get some purple. So I like this. Um, again, you know, in camera, it's really struggling to really do this justice. Um, it, it just is beautiful. Look at that. I'm trying to really... Okay, so that one again is the Natasha Denona Multi-Chrome Liquid Eyeshadow. I like it. I think that it's a great contender. Now, what we're going to put that up again is the Danessa Myricks Beauty. And this is the Infinity Chrome Gemstone Collection. Now, I kept hearing about these. These are the Twin Flame Liquids. Multi-chrome pigment for eyes and face. Now, check this one. It looks, you know, like it's almost the same. But it's got like a pinkish, reddish shift. Let's... Now, this is Danessa Myrick's Beauty and... Now, you don't have to get this kit. I got this kit with these two um, eye pencils, and I will show those in a minute. Now, there is tons of these as well. Um, you know, so what I did today was, I'm going to show you right quick while we have, so I did the twin flames on the bottom, and then I did these flakies we're going to get into next over that. Actually, let's do it with the light on and we'll do it without. So, yeah, this has more of a... Man, this is really... This has, like, a little bit of bluish green. And this is more of, like, a reddish gold. Man, y'all, I'm gonna have to... Hold on. Yeah, okay, I know it looks the same, but you're gonna see right here... This is what I had on the other day when y'all ask me what I had on. Now, I will say, it, you know, again, it's very duochrome, but the Natasha Denona is more like a full... I mean, again, it's a darker color, too, but see the way that's more like a pink-orange... Go ahead and turn the ring light. So, yeah, look how different depending on the light. So, they look, you know, somewhat actually, no, they don't. It's all depending on the light, you guys. Like, look at the difference in these. I mean, it, it look at that the way the light catches them, they're so different. Look, it pulls pink, then it'll pull gold, it'll pull pink. This is more like a greenish blue. And as you can tell here... Okay, let's get into these liners. 
So I'd heard a lot again. These are the twin flames, like I said, non-sponsored. And they come with so many different colors. This is like the little kit I got. This is called, again, Infinity Chrome Gemstone Collection. And I thought, you know what? Since we're going to try, we might as well try the whole. These are great. So you get this one here. It's called Amethyst. And Amethyst is kind of, you'll see, it's like a purplish type. The packaging is on point. So I like these. These are a small tip pencil. Retractable. And look, let's go in the hand here. Ladies, wear your sunscreen. I really, look how little that tip is. Look at that. It's like a purple greenish shift. Yeah, it gives a purple to a green. Let's kick the ring light. I love how fine tipped this is and how small this is. Very precise. Packaging game on point. Okay, here, we'll do the other one, then we'll turn off the ring light. And this one is called Rose Quartz. This one is like a opal-esque type. So there's the tip. This one gives like a opal-esque vibe. This is what I'm wearing because I didn't want to go too crazy overboard. So it's like a pink, pearly, opal-esque, and you will see here in a second. So look at that one. I love the fine, precise tip. These are great. And let's kick off the ring light. Sorry, I'm trying to keep my desk somewhat picked up because we, the next thing is the messy little fellas. Yeah, look at that. See, amazed these are catching with low light better. Look at that. It's like a pearl-esque. Okay, and let's move on to the show stopper. This is why I ordered... Actually, let me show this right quick. This is the lit glitter base daily wear and I seen this and I was like this would be great for the summertime it is no glitter it says no glitter no glory and this was a really good price guys this will last for a while and um it says used to bond all over glitter metallics electrics mica so it says will prevent loose products from floating, flaking, smudging, or creasing great cosmetics. So, I thought, you know what? This will be good just to have to pick up. And it's the lit. Guys, this lit brand has some metallics. I was in between this and their metallics. But I thought, eh, these look interesting. Okay, first things first. We are going to do... These are the Danessa Myrix Beauty Infinity Chrome Flakes. Multi-chrome gel for eyes and face. This one is called Kiss Me. Here is the packaging. And look at this. Wow. Let's kick the light off. It's looking like... Yeah, look at that. It is like a... And guys, I apologize. The camera is just really not doing these justice okay so the only thing I will say these are a little pot for the price point I think these were like 27 bucks but you know okay this is shooting star <clears throat> excuse me I have been so raspy today it's probably one minute it's nice, one minute it's snowing, one minute it's icing. Look at that. 
sorry, I, I, it's like I can't tell what's better to, yeah, look at that. Okay, here we go. Now, this is one of the strangest formulas I have ever used in my entire life. When they say flakies, they mean flakies. Check this out. So it's in like a gel base. And check this. Oh, sorry, y'all. This is, I don't want to get back in there, little buddies. So here's a little component. Let's go ahead and... We don't want that to dry up. And here we go. So, it's interesting. Here, let's... It's really having trouble picking up. See how it's kind of like little flakes? It's like almost you have to build it. It's very interesting, this formula. Look at my finger now there. Like it's almost better if you dab it. So if you get this, you want to really work with it. And look, it's almost better if you dab it. So we're right here on the bottom. It's the camera is just not really doing this justice. So it's like it's flakes and it looks like a metal like chromed out. Look at my finger. It's like so hard to really like. Sorry, y'all. Look at that though. It's, it's so interesting. Okay, y'all, let's move on to the next one. So that was Kiss Me. And this is Shooting Star. So this is more like a blue, green, purple, kind of gold hits. And then this one is more like a deeper purple... They, they were hard to tell online, what, but they definitely, when you see them. So this is Kiss Me. Look at that. So it's more like a purple. And then if you can tell, Shooting Star is more tamed down like a blue pastel purplish where this is more of a darker Okay, what do we do, y'all, first? Okay, we did kiss me. Okay, shooting, wait, no, okay, I'm tripping. Okay, kiss me. <laughs> so look at this one in the pot. This hits more of like a... Look at that. Is that not beautiful? Okay, here we go. And it, like I said, it is a gel base. So, oh, you're not going to need a glitter glue with this. Now, you could probably use... This is a new formula for me. You could probably use it. It would stay on longer, but... Let's just do a swatch, and then we're going to play around. Okay, yeah, see, that is way more hardcore... The other one's more of like a pastel. But see how they're, like, they're little flakes in there? So you could build this up, you know. Um, I will say, look at that. And guys, this will be beautiful outside. But see how they're like little flakes in there? Let's just do a little play around here. Of. Let's just play around. So I have one shooting star. I don't know if you can see, like I said. Let's do a little bit of kiss me in the middle here. 
Man, I got a story time for you guys on our live tonight. You guys are going to think I'm... This mirror just reminded me of... Wow, that is gorgeous. Okay, so this is the eye with. Let me see if I can. We're over here with a little bit in the middle and without. a little bit here but I like that it's got the gel in there like I said because this would be you know to work with this without the gel in it would be quite the you know and for the price point it's good that it already comes with the gel So, like I said, they're definitely buildable. And to get that full chromed out look, you're going to want to let them dry. And it's better to let your eyes close so they don't crease. I did read about that. So, here we go. Wow, guys, this is really hard to... Let's add another coat here. But yeah, look at, I mean, these are just so cool. Now they, they do, you know, like if you wanted a full blown out all the way metallic look, you know, you're going to want to work, but look, it is doable, but you're going to want to let them dry and then just, you know, kind of, but I think these are awesome. You guys, I think these, if you're like me, you really like a wow factor and you want to dab them. I found, like I said, that the finger is the best. Um, the finger's way better than a brush. Now, the only thing is, once your finger starts getting gummy, you know, they will stick back. See, look. But once you get the groove of them, I think they're awesome. I really totally do. I think they're pretty cool. And, you know, do you get a little bit? Yes. But I think they are definitely in a league of their own. See, they're picking. I need to use another finger. They're picking up to, um, so don't keep going in with the same finger. They're picking up right on the other. So start off, yeah. Okay, that's the thing too. Don't keep going over the same spot over and over. Oh, sorry, y'all. I'm coming like... No, I'm just messing it up. Anyways, y'all get the drift. I'm going to get this spot right. Hold on. So basically, pat, 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 move on. Don't try and be precise. Let that coat dry and then move on. But look at that. I like these, but let, like I said, let... See, I did it again.
stunning. Stunning. <laughs> All right, y'all. Well, let me know what you guys think of these. And um, I dig it. I think they are definitely something that I have never, ever seen before. I think that they are, you know, they're expensive for the price point, but there's nothing like them. I think the liners are cool. Do you need the liners? No, but I figured since I had never ordered from Beautylish and I had, you know, met free shipping that I might as well, you know, get. Um, I really like the Natasha Denona. I think it stands up. I think it's, you know, look at that. I mean, they all just... Now, these are flakes, of course. But look at that. Now, the Natasha Denona does feel the softest. This feels a little bit more... I don't know how to say. But the Natasha Denona, I mean, look at that. Well, you guys know my hair look. I mean, it barely comes off. That is nice. I'm going to have to say the Natasha Denona is my favorite. It's more of a full coverage. But again, they're two different entities. But I really like this. I mean, that is gorgeous. So, I'm going to say the Natasha Denona one is more my preference. It's a more full coverage in your face. Again, like I said, they're two different entities. But they're kind of the same thing. But, like I said, they both have different color stories. The Natasha Denona does have more. The Danessa Myricks does have more. I do love this little kit. I do love that it does come with the two liners. Do you need the liners? No. Are they great and unique? 100%. But I'm going to say the Natasha Denona, the liquid chrome eyeshadow, is a showstopper. I mean, that's just gorgeous. Where this one, you know, it's kind of like you got to build it, you know, again, different colors, but it's just seeming like for formulation, this one is thicker, just formula in general. The flakies, they're going to take some use to get and, you know, play with them, but I do think you could get a super, you know, chromed out look, you know, just really take the time. You know I'm impatient. I should have let them dry, but all right, you guys, with thumbs up, let's turn on this and see if it makes any bit of difference and yeah i like it so like i said i did the twin flames and this kit like i said is the which one is this one hold on y'all before you end up asking me and i'm like i don't know okay this one is star ruby star ruby and this one comes with the Rose Quartz and Amethyst. Ro Amethyst and Rose Quartz and was it Star Ruby is the collection that I got. And again, non-sponsored Beautylish. Um, yeah, so pretty cool, but I'm going to have to say this is my favorite. I mean, it's, again, just formula-wise, look at that. I mean, it's staying put. This just looks... If you guys look, again, it's on a different... But this seems to be a little more... It's cracking more, where this is a really smooth finish. All right, thumbs up if you guys like these type of videos. I know we're all over the place over here. And get ready. We have another video coming up. I am pumped about it. I've been looking at this, looking at this forever. And, um, you know... I had one of you little bad beasts on just contact me and I said, wait till I get a P.O. box and if you want me to review it, you know, cool. I'm not tripping about it, but I had looked at something and they was like, yo. So, I will see you guys back in a little bit. Have a great day, great night. Make sure you're still subscribed. Or if you're not subscribed, my name is Kaya. Again, we do a little bit of everything. Have a great day, guys. Let me know out of these. Do you like the Danessa Myricks? Do you like the Natasha Denona? And what do y'all think of these new flakes? Again, they're called Infinity Chrome Flakies. What do y'all think about these? I think they're pretty interesting. All right, y'all. I will talk to you later. Kaya is out. <laughs>